Welcome to the Climate Viewer 3D tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to use Climate Viewer 3D in about two minutes. Over here on the left side you have controls that help you to control the angle and the zoom of the map. You hit the circle in the middle and it'll reset you back to the default. Just above that you have a date chooser which allows you to change the imagery date that I'm about to show you. Over here in the top right we have a scale which tells you about how big everything is appearing. And then this is where all of the meat and potatoes of the map happens. You click here to add layers, here to share layers, and here to delete layers. Layers are maps. So we're going to click that plus at the top and it's going to bring up the menu on the sidebar. And as you can see there's a bunch of buttons up here at the top. Most importantly the close button in the top corner there or clicking over here we'll close it back close so that's how you get in and out of the menu this is where all the fun happens and there are many different categories as you can see so you have several categories up here and at the bottom you have the base layer the base layer is what appears currently on the screen you can change it to several different colors you can even show like the satellite uh, the nighttime view where you see the earth at night and as you zoom in you'll see that this stuff refines and it gets pretty sharp so pretty cool stuff we have a search box this will help you to search for locations like New York and you just hit that and it'll take you there three categories at the top these three alerts weather and satellites are live so these are always pulled from the internet live as they come we have earthquakes click here over here on the side you're gonna notice that each layer has um, an eye next to it the eye is for information it tells you about the layer some of them will have another icon that pop up like this tree if you click this tree it will actually list all of the earthquakes that are currently visible on the map if you click on the text link here you fly to the earthquake pretty freaking cool so I'm gonna go back up here again and hit this that'll zoom me back out and I'm gonna close it simply by clicking it again if you see the eyeball icon here now it's gone pretty simple so that's how the whole ent entire thing works I'll give you a different example over here we're gonna go to weather layers and I'm gonna go to radar and uh, just to make it really cool looking I'm gonna make this thing black and I'm gonna click on next rad radar boom we have Raiders so over here there's a different icon that appeared it has these little sliders and as you can see these have opacity on it right there slide that brightness contrast make it black and white pretty freaking cool so again I can click up here on the trash icon to clear all that off it'll clear all the layers simultaneously have things like lightning uh, all the different rainfall totals space weather is finally back to climate viewer 3d uh, you just click that bad boy and it's gonna load up and there's your total electron content let's do a different example I'm gonna go over here to the satellite section and I'm gonna click on modus terra and I'm gonna change the date and I'm gonna go back to the 21st and as we can see the satellite is here now I'm gonna click this and I'm gonna zoom in here and you click the share button and that gives you a URL that you can share where the map is currently and all that I'm gonna click it and it's gonna load it up and it's gonna fly in and this is what people will see if you share that link that's the whole purpose of climate three viewer 3d um, the tutorial is pretty much done so come over here click some layers you can share them with friends with the position that is currently set on the screen and the date that is selected climate viewer 3d is the future of activism and allows you to do all kinds of fun things there are 435 maps currently on the website uh, you just guys you guys just saw a sneak preview of something I'm about to upload but come in here check out you know things like nuclear reactors government spy facilities like the NSA weather control experiments ionospheric heaters and missile defense radars lasers oh my all of the encyclopedic stuff from uh, George Stiller's my reading maps and much more Climate Viewer 3D is available at climateviewer.org. It is free of charge. I am Jim Lee, creator of Climate Viewer 3D. Have a wonderful day. Knowing is half the battle.